Now, the wait is over. Johnny B's radio showgram is once again the showcase for radio broadcasting history. The whole world's watching. So let's get it on. I have to do, just relax. Personally, I'd rather wear this one, because I don't want to look like it here. I'm gonna win this fight? That's not the question. I know I'm gonna win this has entered the hey, area. Let's pay attention here. What's happening? Donnie Osmond has come without an introduction. He has walked into the ring, being let out on a pharaoh's. What is that, Buzz? What the hell is that? Looks like a bed. Buzz. <laughs> well, you sure put things into perspective for it me. Looks like a slab from a funeral. I don't know. Power. We've introduced the judges. Ladies and gentlemen, the music, please. The music, please. It does look like a bed. Looks Let like me hear the button. music! Now, if he falls off this thing, he's going to land about 20 feet on these people. From Ogden... From Ogden, Utah. Starring in Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. Made his professional singing debut at four. 23 gold records with a nine year period. Five feet, nine inches, weighing at 145 pounds. Child singer, teen idol, comeback kid, wearing red with white trim. Ladies and gentlemen, he's one bad apple. Danny the Stormin' Mormon Osmond! Dances into the ring. And he does have his game face on. There's a bad look on uh, Donny Osmond's face, folks. Oh, that's an entrance that's right, right out of Ali, isn't it? That, that'll be dear to his heart. Jack, of course, uh, Danny, like a, the champ that he is, is waiting. He's waiting. He's going to make his entrance when he feels like it. Right, Ben? That's the strategy that uh, all the... You're the right on do. top of it. That's the strategy. I could barely hear what is going on now because this crowd is revved up. Ladies and gentlemen... You started it all. Donny Osmond is in the ring. Donny Osmond is in the ring. Johnny Bellino, the uh, referee for tonight, has introduced the Ortiz family. And they will be the judges ringside. And now, ladies and gentlemen... Music, please! Who that boy with Don King over there? He is originally from Pennsylvania. Leah former, just pointed out Don King. Former child star of the TV's Partridge family. Found by the National Enquirer to be dead, broke, and starving. Saved a Canadian man from suicide. Signed on with The Loop this year where he does nights. He is five feet, seven inches tall. He's wearing the black and white shorts. He is weighing in 155 pounds. He's buffed, he's pumped, and he smokes three packs of cigarettes a day. Danny, the dead dude, Fanny Bonaduce! Don King, Don King down there. Yeah. 
Hey, Don King, man. It is Don King. It is Don King. Oh, hey, hi, Don. Don King is here. Danny Bonaduce. Danny is now in the ring. Hey, Buzz. Buzz. Would you say these guys look serious? I mean, I, really, dead serious. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, he's out of his And now Bonaduce's losing his mind. He's trying Danny to get the crowd pumped up right now. Danny is out of his mind. He is, he is uh -oh. nuts. Ladies he's shadow boxing himself. Jack, Jack Brickhouse, he is out of his mind. Jack Brickhouse is here Jack, with his Jack, how do you like the demeanor of Danny Bonaduce in the ring? Jack. Jack Brickhouse, can you hear us? Jack. Jack, what do you think of Danny Bonaduce in the ring right now? <laughs> I'll tell you, I'll have to like his chances. I'll tell you seriously. He's never had a bout, but he's had uh, something like 133 karate bouts. Yeah. That means he's got a lot of ring time. He knows what he's doing inside of a ring. Plus, he was on a failed television show, which helps. We ben Bentley, can I ask you? That was Jack Brickhouse, Hall of Famer. Ben Bentley, can I ask you a question here in the pandemonium tonight? Certainly. Do you think it is a wise for a boxer to come in that fired up? Could that hurt him in the fight tonight? No, it can't hurt him. It can help him. It can He's help. all shot up right now. He's all charged up. When you get a fighter that walks in the ring all charged up, you got the fight half won. Ooh. Because if he is that excited now, I cannot wait for the bell to ring. This has got, you know, there's a lot of hype in this fight tonight. And I will tell you, I believe it's going to live up to the bill. I believe it is going to live up to the bill. This will be on ESPN tomorrow. All right, let's go. Hey, the guys I want Put on the my show side. on the road. Really? Johnny oh, Bellino, Don. Let's get ready to rumble. Is that Don King? Is that Don King, Leon? Now, you know him. There got to be Don King. Huh? He took $7 million from you, didn't he? Oh, that guy took more than that. Oh, that's Can we work up a match? <laughs> Leon Spinks is here, former world heavyweight champion, a star set in the Ventana of the China Club, WLUV Chicago. Give him the winner. Danny, uh, Danny has brought his wife Gretchen along with him. Say hello to Gretchen Bonaduce in the corner. Well, Danny has a very large entourage, and most of them are women. Yeah, he has a large entourage. I have no idea who they are. And I will tell you, Buzz, at least they look like women. With Danny, you can never be sure. Yeah, I'd say after seeing the transsexuals. Uh oh. <laughs> Danny just said to Buzz, F you. Hold your language. Now I heard what you said. Uh oh. Danny, this now, is so exciting, even the transsexuals have wood right now. <laughs> they have wood. All right, now, ladies and gentlemen, I wanted to say hello. I wanted to say hello and talk to the gentlemen, Danny and Donnie, but I believe that is not going to happen. Buzz, would you agree? No, I don't think no, they're not. It's ridiculous. They are post verbal. Turn the music off. Johnny Bellino, please tell the boxers what is about to happen tonight. We go to ringside we now. We need a headgear here. Johnny Bellino, the referee, Yo. is telling the fighters to put some headgear on. Johnny, I'm going to judge. Alfonso's going to ref. All right. Okay. We have moved the Ortiz family into the ring now. Johnny Bellino. We'll be talking. These bouts are sanctioned by yes. the Illinois State Athletic Commission. No, by the West Loop Athletic Commission. By the <laughs> West. Oh, what do they come in? What do now, you want, Jack? Hey, Jack. If any real trouble starts, I want those two handlers of Danny's on my side. All right, let's pay <laughs> attention now. Would you sit? Yeah. All if right, the man. Bears had them, nobody would ever score on That's them. That's right. Come out over here. All right, Get here we go. Here. Johnny Bellino is in the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're not here, you're not anywhere. Come on over here. Come if you're not here. here, you're not anywhere. Hey, you guys, let's get over here so we can start this thing. Let's go. Johnny Bellino is right, first of all, you guys like each other? No. no. <laughs> Are you going to whip somebody's butt? Right, no. Who's going to win? I, I will. Oh, that sounds good to me. Alphonse, you want to say something? Yes. You guys both know the rules. I want you to guys have a good, clean fight. No low blows. Listen to my commands at all times. Good luck to both of you. Here we go. Who are you going with? Out of the box, Leon. Who would you go with? Don't box me. Oh, Jack, Jack is yours to do the blow by blow. Leon Spinks is picking Danny Bonaduce. Danny and Donnie are ready to go, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, give it a go. The waiting fight is about to begin. This is the moment we've been waiting for. Danny Bonaduce and Donnie Osmond. Uh, Let's get ready to rumble. They are both. Fine. This is the loudest. I there we go. We've got headphones on. We can't hear. All right. They touch gloves. They come out. Jack, do the blow by blow. Danny's saying hit me. Danny is saying hit me to Donnie. Just hit me. Danny throws a left. Doesn't connect. Danny tries to right. A combination of the right oh. and the right. He's oh. getting him over the head. Another oh right and left. God. He's got him into the corner right now. He's going after him. He's got him. A left and a right and another right. Danny 
has pummeled him immediately. Donny comes back in. Oh, Donny's hitting him all over the face. He's not hitting him. He's not hurting him. Jack, what do you think? Jack, Jack. what just happened there? I think they're both serious. <laughs> they're very serious. One of, them, one of them's going to win the Academy Award. That would be Danny Bonaduce. Ferdy Pacheco Kilman, what's going on? Well, quite honestly, I'm surprised that I'm uh, glad Donny they Os both have headgears. Otherwise, a couple of pretty good showbiz careers could be in danger. Donny Osmond is more than holding I, I his own see. here, although he's getting hit right now. Some rapid punches there by... Uh -oh. There goes his headgear. Uh -oh. There goes uh -oh. Danny's headgear. Head headgear. Danny's headgear's off. Danny's headgear's off. That's hey. what happens to the rest. And Danny is also noticeably out of breath. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, he should get that cigarette out of his left glove. Out of breath. I will Pumping tell you, it might sound like you're joking, but I got to tell you, these guys, as Jack said, these guys are... They're not joking. They're not joking. Danny started the fight. He, he took the fight to uh, Donnie, but Donnie came right back, Johnny. He Donnie's in this him. fight. He's in the fight. They're resuming the fight right now. Again. Here we go. Danny's leading with his head. That's the problem. Uh-oh. Wild haymaker. Johnny. There goes his head. <laughs> Here again. He can't see. He's wrapping him up. They're wrestling now. They're wrestling right now. He's got him in a headlock. Danny had Finn, Donnie in a hot headlock. Is that allowable? Is that allowable? No. No. Who? <laughs> no. You cannot wrestle a guy like that. It's illegal. You cannot wrestle that. Either that or referee would have stopped the fight. Right, Jack? Question, is this a boxing match or best two out of three falls? <laughs> it is a three two-minute rounds, Jack. It has become a wrestling match. They mean business. Leon, you can't hold a guy like that. I oh, think warned. He's got a couple of headlocks. They both have a headlock. That's Justice to burn Gagne. Okay, let's talk about it for a second. Jack? And Ben Bentley, Jack Brickhouse and Ben Bentley, tell me what you saw there in the first round. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll let the master talk first. What do you think, Jack? Jack Brickhouse, what did you see there? I'll tell you something. If they didn't have those headgears, this thing wouldn't go three rounds. Because no, it would have ended in a round. One of them would be gone. This and who would you say? This is Ezra Charles versus Joe Walcott. Whoa, fight. here comes our transsexual round girl. Our transsexual round girl. Oh, man, oh, man. It's Holy mackerel there. They're in the corners. Danny and Donnie are in their respective corners. There's a one-minute break. Swing it way with Sammy K. Oh, man. Hey. I'll tell you, that, that round is that, very close to even. Really it, you man. think so? Very close to even. I wonder, we don't know what the judges are saying, obviously. Jack, would you agree Jack Brickhouse Buzz is saying that round is very close to even? Very close to even. Would you agree? Yes, I would say very yeah, close. Very so. even. Right. And for a 10-10? Would Watch you say that that's a beautiful man or a woman? Yeah. <laughs> That's Very the nicest Are even. we under the 10-point system here? 10-point must. 10-point yes. yeah. system. Yeah. Johnny Bellino. Jonathan doesn't understand I, I, No, I do. I'm going to ask him right now. Johnny Bellino. We need to know what kind of point system we're on here tonight. Johnny well, Bellino, right. we're on a 2018, and we can't tell you who's ahead at this point, but I don't think it's going to go three. All I would right. say that first Ooh. round was even. All right. Our uh, ESPN tote Maddox showed that three punches landed for each guy. I saw something yeah. happen there. It really did look even. It did. You know, you know, uh, they're Johnny, getting ready. Yes, sir. In amateur boxing, there are no draws. There must be a decision. There must be a decision in amateur boxing. Ben Bentley has just said, no one can walk out a draw. Two men enter, one man must leave. <laughs> <laughs> Round two, Johnny. Round two. Here they come out swinging. Both of them. They're grabbing each other. Dan Danny oh. with a shot to the oh, belt. Danny's headgear is off. Danny they separate. Is off again. The referee should put his headgear on right now. Put it on now. This is oh. a travesty of a sham of his a travesty, is off. Johnny. His headgear is off, Leon. Leon, Jack Brickhouse is calling it even. What are you calling it? Oh, uh, I don't know what to say. See, I'm not keep making the headgear off on purpose so he can stop the round so he can get the rest. All right, Leon Spinks is saying that Danny Buzz is taking the headgear off on purpose to stop the round. Yeah, that would be a smart tactic. <laughs> that is what Leon Spinks Danny with the right. Danny's leading with his head. There goes the headgear oh. again. And he claims he got a thumb in the eye. Now, Danny doesn't want the He's going after him without uh -oh. the headgear. He's Danny going, does now not he's wrestling want the him. He's throwing him into the ropes. This is a wrestling match. This is a sham of a travesty of a canard. Danny is refusing to put the headgear on. He is fighting. Oh, Donnie hitting on the break. He got hit, he got hit without the headgear. Donnie hit him on the break, as Ferdy Pacheco Kilman just pointed out. Somebody get the headgear on right. All right, that is exactly true. Somebody get that headgear on tight. If you got a trainer over there, tell him to tighten it up. If we have to shave Danny's head to get that headgear on right, we got to do it. We will it. do what we have to do. 
Ben, Leon Spinks saying that Danny might be having a headgear loose on purpose to breathe, to take a break. Yeah, to take a little break. That's an old trick. An old, old trick. An old trick. You sure. Know that. that and the paraglider yeah, trick with the toilet. I think Aquan is doing it. Aquan is doing it on purpose. They tried to tie it up twice. Well, it came it. out twice. Now he They're doing it on purpose. Uh, we'll okay. see him down and see what Leon said later. Now you see how long? <laughs> you see the rest he's getting? He you see getting, the rest he's getting? This is, this is what they said would happen. They said that he would tire in the ring. They said that Danny would tire, and now he's getting a little bit of rest. But he wants to go. Johnny Bellino, the referee, is stepping into the ring to feel, to see why the headgear is so loose. Donnie has been waiting patiently in the corner. And Danny is ready to go. Danny's been ready to go, but the headgear is not. I think Danny has been. Johnny has gained a lot of confidance. Man. Johnny is. Yeah. Danny has gained a lot of confidence. Here we go. No question. Yeah, now Donnie, Donnie inviting him to yes. come in. Beckoning inviting him to come, come over. Come Where did Buzz go? I'm right here. I can't see you. Oh, sorry, man. All right, they resume the action now. <laughs> Danny, oh, all right. Whoa. Danny. All right, he hits him whoa. in the back of the head. He's got him. He's got Donnie. He he's plastered him on the left, uh -oh. on the right. He's got him against the ropes. He's hitting him with that other right. Donnie's trying to fight back. He's trying to wrestle him away. Danny with a right, an uppercut. Danny trying to push him away and punch him. That was that was a nice move. Hey, Ben. There's your, there's your mic, Ben. That was a nice flurry right there, Very wasn't good. it? Very good. Well, once again, the head gear comes head gear. off. Head Hold it now, hold it. End of the round. Headgear has come off again. Headgear has come off again. They have gone to their prospective corners, and they are getting ready for the next round. Are we in the round? What round are we at, guys? We're third round we're coming round up. Round two. Okay, up. Buzz, Ben, Bruce. We're looking at it. Leon Spinks is with us. You take a look at that last round, that second round. What do we got going? What happened? Who's winning? Who well, looks good? Danny Bonaducci landed some very uh, good, powerful combination. The cleanest punch of the fight. When he got him in the corner. When he had him in the corner, I thought he had him there. Although Donnie does not look like he's stoppable because he just keeps coming back. This will be the round, even up now. This is the round, and Johnny Bolino is telling us the referees have it called even up. I was just going to say, this fight is even. All right. Uh, that's Ben Bentley saying that. That's Ben well, Bentley. <laughs> it's very well rehearsed. I know. And, and, and <laughs> well, this round, this round will tell it all. This yeah. round, last round, we tell it all. Let's go, right. man. Third round, we tell it all. Third round tells it all. Two men enter, one man leaves. There can be no draw in amateur boxing. They take a five minute break. Two well, men enter, five one minutes. man leaves. I'll tell you, whatever Two happens in this enter. last round, this one was no leaves. mismatch. Two men Donny enter. Osmond's done more than hold his own. And the crowd takes up the chant. Two men enter, one man leaves. 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 That's the only way to do it, Leon. When you are in that corner and you are tired, you must think of only one thing, the end of the fight. Is that correct, Leon? Think about yourself. That's all. You just make sure you be the one that leaves. Round three has started. Here it goes, Leon. Donnie rushes across the uh, ring for Danny. They're now locked in a uh, clinch. Danny with a right to the face of Donnie. Donnie trying to jab his way out of the clinch. Once Danny again, is... they're hugging each other. There's more hugging than hitting going on here. I don't think so. Danny is leading with his head, Buzz, isn't he? Yes, he is. Hey, Leon. All right, they break. Here they go again. Here they go. Squaring off. Danny leads with his head. A right to Whoa. the face of Donny. He's got him against the ropes. Oh. Danny with another right to the head. Donny trying to rabbit punch him now. Danny up, Danny up against the ropes. Danny with a yeah, wild this, haymaker. This is a great fight. This is yeah. a great fight. Danny with a right to the whoa, head. Whoa, Donny does a spin around move that I've never seen before. Danny misses <laughs> with a right. They're up against the ropes. Danny up against the turnbuckle. Looks like that Danny's trying to he's trying, he's to, trying to lace him. <laughs> what happened, Leon? Man, Hagrid, come on. Hagrid, come on. Hey, take the Hagrid up. The black, the black head They're again. standing around. Danny yeah, charges. Danny again, come off again. Danny with the right, he hits him up. He got oh. his chin up against the ropes. Danny hitting him in the back of the head. That's it. Oh, That's over. Right. It's all over. The fight is over. The fight is over. Leon, that is the end of round three. Leon. Oh. Right, Leon, what was, Leon was saying something. I didn't hear what you said. What were you saying, Leon? I think Hager coming off again. 
and one of the black hair girls coming off again. So I don't know. The one's great. The one's great is one. Bruce. All right, Bruce, I don't know. You're saying something about I can't barely hear you. Yep. This crowd is out of their mind. I will tell you, I don't know who's the winner here. Yeah. I'll tell you, Donny Osmond proved something to us today. Everybody thought he was a little push boy, but he came in, he fought the good fight. I gotta give both of these fighters credit for being game fighters here today. What you say? And they're, they're hugging. hugging. They are hugging. in the middle of the ring. They're hugging. Buzz, would you agree that Donny surprised you in the ring? Buzz, can he, nobody Ladies can hear Ladies and gentlemen. This is the noisiest I've ever heard. Let's go now. Let's go now ringside to Johnny Bellino. Ringside. Quiet, ladies and gentlemen, let's go now to Johnny Bellino. We have a split decision. <laughs> oh, we got to we got to have a winner. We're still a winner. We're still a winner. Judge Alphonse Ortiz, senior, scores 60-58, Bonaducci. I got a fortune riding on this. Yeah. Just kiss it goodbye. <laughs> Judge Sam DeSera scores 60-58, Osman. Oh, man. Who do I have to pay? I just, I thought they said in an amateur fight. One more, there's be... one more score. Oh, one more I'm score. sorry. One more. Johnny Bellino scores 60-58, Bonaduce. Ow! Oh, oh, that was big. That was big. No, no, no. That was big. No, no, no. Leon Spinks is calling it a fix. That was big. Leon that was big. is calling it a fix. Danny Bonaduce wins a split decision, big. ladies Buzz, and gentlemen. Buzz, oh. wouldn't you agree that the reason is that Danny took the attack to Johnny during the entire fight? No, no, no. Hold on, because... Both rounds, Donnie no. came rushing out and Higgins got very aggressive, but Danny Bonaducci landed three of the cleanest punches in the fight. I imagine that's what put the judges Leon, on his Leon side. disagrees. What about it, Leon? Leon, Leon you say it's fixed. Because my man Higgins got coming off of the head, so he had to do that, though. That's the way it is. I go, I go with Ozzy. I think he won. We will have to slow it down again, as I say, Bruce. The headgear came but off, you. and he claims that that was a ploy by Danny Bonaducci, and so Donny Osmond should have won. Uh, okay, thank you. Yeah. Bruce Don is interpreting the United Nations. <laughs> Bruce is interpreting for Leon's I tell you, I think Donny Osmond surprised everybody that No doubt about it. No doubt, no about, doubt about it. it. He fought. It he was fought. incredible. He definitely fought. Now, can we get a mic? <laughs> can we get a mic over to Danny, please? Can we get a mic over to Danny? Danny, Leon Spinks is saying that the ploy, the ploy was to loosen the headgear. No, yeah, the head get them off your head. The headgear would not stay on, because Donnie was killing me. Don, I'll tell you why Donnie won. I'll tell you why Donnie won. Why they give hey, you? Don't be an idiot, Spinks, I'll kick your ass. <laughs> oh, I'm scared. Oh. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Once again, Danny getting carried away. Ooh, don't forget, next month, it's Danny and Leon Spinks right here again. Come on, Grand Man. Tonight. I just want to say, man. let me just say one thing. In all seriousness, I trained hard because I saw him in the gym and he's big. I never expect him to hurt me the way he hurt me. To come on the way he came on, I give him nothing but accolades. You're the best. You are a total champion, man.